This place is fire, not getting lighter. See the light getting brighter. My eyes can comprehend the future ahead. Magandang tanghali po sa bawat isa at welcome po ulit sa ating 3pm daily devotion and prayer. At mga kapatid, tayo pa rin po ay nagpapatuloy sa pag-aaral about the ABC of the G12 vision. At tayo po ay nasa week 6 na. Amen? So ako po si Pastor Israel at ako po ang inyong makakasama ngayong hapon na ito sa ating pong pag-aaral. At uh, sa ating pong pag-aaral, day by day, ay natututo po tayo about the cell network. Amen? Yan po ang ating topic this week. So from the meaning of cell group to its essential characteristics, uh, roles, and purpose. Amen? Amen? So alam ko po tayong lahat ay natututo at uh, sinusubaybayan po natin ang ating uh, 3pm daily devotion and prayer. So, yan po ang ating pinag-aaralan natin during the past days. And today po, mas papalalimin pa po natin ang ating pag-aaral. Amen? As we talk about the multiplication within the cell group. Yan po ang ating topic today. Multiplication within the cell group. Napaka-interesting na topic, kaya makinig po tayong lahat. Amen? So, gusto ko po kayong tanungin, sino po dito ang member ng uh, cell group? O kaya naman kung isa kang leader ng isang uh, cell group, ay pwede po ba natin i-shout out sa ating comment section? At sabihin po natin, ako yun. Amen? So, ikaw ay isang cell group member o kaya ikaw naman ay isang cell group leader? Yan, sabihin mo sa ating comment section, lagi mo sa ating comment section, ako yun. Amen? At kung ikaw ay belong sa isang cell group, gusto ko pong sabihin sa iyo na it's time for you or for us to multiply. Dahil ako po, kabilang din po ako sa isang cell group. At the same time, isa rin po akong uh, cell leader. Amen? So it's time for us to multiply. Ang uh, cell group po ay my capability to multiply. nag agree po po tayo dyan. I said po, has the capability to multiply. So, kung ikaw ay isang leader with two to three members, this is for you para ma-reach mo ang 12 mo. Amen? Para sa iyo ang message ng Lord ngayong hapon na ito. And if you are a leader who has 12 members already, ay huwag ka mag-alala para rin sa iyo to. <laughs> Amen? So, you can raise leaders on your cell group or even... Um, open another set of 12. So, ibig sabihin ay um, ikaw ay makakaraise ng leaders at syempre madadagdagan, multiply ang iyong cell. Para rin sa iyo to. Amen? So, kung ikaw naman ay isang member, this is also for you. Amen? So, upang ikaw mismo ay magmultiply or eventually open your own cell and reach your own 12. So, para po ito sa ating lahat. 
Ayan. So, ang pag-open po ng cell group, according to Pastor Cesar Castellanos, is comparable to taking the ark of God. Bakit po? Because it radiates the light of the gospel to a whole community. Wow! Amen? Kaya nga po, madalas natin naririnig na kung kaya mong maging faithful sa maliliit na bagay tulad ng cell group, ay uh, ang Panginoon will also continue to place you over much. So, kung ikaw ay nagiging faithful sa cell group, ay talagang papalaguin ito ng Panginoon. So, maliit man po in numbers ang isang cell group, pero we cannot underestimate its power dahil kaya po nito mag-multiply. Amen! So, multiplication po is a natural or a supernatural process brought about by the Holy Spirit. Amen? It's a supernatural process brought about the Holy Spirit. So, kung ikaw ay isang leader, you will be the one multiplying. Naniniwala po ba tayo dyan? Ikaw ang change agent. So, sa mga leaders po, let's type on the comment section, I am a change agent. Yan, para po yan sa mga leaders. Yes, iyan ang role mo. Amen? You are the change agent. So when we work closely with the Holy Spirit, we will be able to obtain multiplication. Amen? And growth. Kaya po napakahalaga that we seek the presence and works of the Holy Spirit sa ating pong mga cell groups. Amen? So as we learn about multiplication this afternoon, ay nais ko pong ishare ang uh, seven advices of Pastor Cesar Castellanos in his book entitled The ABC of the G12 Vision. So, ito po. Seven. Seven advices. Amen? And um, it will help our cell groups to multiply. Amen? So, makinig po tayong lahat. Ang una po dyan is become an expert in the strategy God gives you. Wow! So, yan po ang una. So, God will give you a divine strategy. Amen? So, let us remember na kahit po sa mga strategies, uh, ang mga strategies are, are, are won in the secret place. Amen? At uh, mahalaga po na um, we work towards it with all our hearts. Yan. So, meron kang strategy. Become an expert. And the strategy God gives you. Yun po ang ating una. Pangalawa is have weekly goals. Yan. So, weekly ay meron kang goals. So, uh, gusto ko pong tanong yun. Sino po ba dito yung mahilig mag-journal or mahilig mag-list ng task for the week? Yan yung talagang meron kang calendar. Nandun yung mga gagawin mo. Nandun yung mga uh, task mo. Yung tipong naglilista ka talaga ng goals mo sa work, sa studies, or even sa personal life mo. Yan. Sino po yung mga taong ganon? So, maaari in written notes or by heart. Amen? So, in cell group multiplication, um, eto naman po, it is essential na mag-set din po tayo ng goals. Amen? Again, have weekly goals. And let us plan with the Lord how many souls ang gusto pa natin ma-win each week. Amen? So, dapat nasa goals po natin yan. Nasa weekly goals po natin yan. Yun po number two. Number three is visualize the people you want to win. Amen? Visualization is an essential process for every conquest. So, kailangan po natin tandaan na mahalaga po ang vision sa ating cell group. Amen? Napakahalaga po ng vision in our cell group. And you cannot conquer what you have not first seen in the spiritual realm. So, visualize the people you want to win. Amen? Pakatlo po iyon. At ang pang-apat is schedule fasting, intercession, and prayer for people and their needs. So, kung meron nga po tayong goal, at meron din tayong vision pero hindi naman po natin ito pinapanalangin, it will be senseless. It will be senseless kung wala pong prayer. So, uh, isa pa, it will be powerless because it is limited. So, tayo lang po yun as human. Ginagawa natin yun as human when we do not pray. Pero alam nyo po, when we pray, when we intercede, and when we fast, the Lord will move supernaturally. 
At yan po ang gusto natin sa mga cell groups natin, yung word na supernatural. The Lord will move supernaturally. The power and the help becomes unstoppable and limitless. Wow! So, dapat po ay nakaschedule ang ating fasting, ang ating intercession, at ang ating pananalangin for the people and their needs. Yun po ang pangapat. Ang panglima naman po is learn how to put on effective evangelistic events. Amen? Hindi lang po basta event. Dapat po ay effective. Amen? So, alam niyo po, yung mga... Um, Win-win natin, sometimes nawawala pong interest nila to meet us or to join us kung sila po ay hinihikayat natin in a very religious way. So, ganun po yun. Parang, uh, okay, sige, uh, ayoko nang sumama kasi parang paulit-ulit naman. So, yung mga hinihikayat natin ay nawawala ng interest. So, make sure to put on an event, uh, effective evangelistic event. Amen. So, kaya nga po, isa sa pahay ni Pastor Cesar Castellanos na every activity should be geared toward demonstrating the love of God and a genuine interest for each person. Yan, dapat naipapakita natin yung pagmamahal ng Panginoon at naipapakita natin na interesado tayo sa kanila. Kaya po, alamin po muna natin ang background ng tao na gusto nating i-win. Know their interest. Talagang alamin mo yung mga favorites nila, yung mga simpleng bagay pero kapag nalaman nila na alam natin, it makes them feel that we care for them. Amen? So yun po dapat ang ating ginagawa. Kaya, you may invite them out and have bonding time with them because you love and care for them. Amen? Mahal po natin sila, we care for them, kaya gusto natin na talaga mag-grow din sila sa ating Panginoon. Amen. Yun po ang number five. Number six is maintain a level of excellence. Sige nga po, let's type sa comment section, excellence. The word excellence. Amen. So it is important that we do not start a cell um, with enthusiasm, preparing every detail, and then allow the level to drop. Yun talaga nag-prepare ka, tapos um, yung mga detalye nandoon, and then afterwards, parang biglang bagsak na lang. So, a clear mark of a soul winner is excellence. So, kailangan husayan po natin dahil ang ginagawa po natin ay para sa ating Panginoon. Amen? We are doing it for the Lord. And number seven, lastly po, I continue the full process of the ladder of success with every new person. Amen? So, kung meron po tayong uh, bago na na-invite sa cell group, ay i-continue po natin ang ladder of success. So, ito po ay isang proseso, uh, proseso. at tuloy-tuloy po natin itong ginagawa because it is the vision of God. It is our vision too. Amen? Yun po ang number seven. And uh, alam nyo po ba, ang multiplication po ay design sa atin ng Panginoon. Naniniwala po ba kayo dyan that we multiply sa lahat ng aspeto ng ating buhay even in the aspect of having your cell group. So kung ikaw ay my cell group, be reminded this afternoon that you should receive, believe, and achieve the blessings of multiplication. Amen? In the cell group. Because the Lord that, uh, does not just add but He multiplies. Amen? So alam ko po, marami po tayong natutunan. Ngayon po ay mananalangin po tayo. And if you have prayer requests, ay ilagay niyo po ito sa ating comment section. May mga kasama po tayong pastors and leaders sa ating pong uh, pananalangin. Amen? Let us pray. Panginoon, marami pong salamat sa iyong salita ngayong hapon na ito. We have been encouraged, Lord God, to become excellent in multiplying our cell group. Dahil alam namin, Panginoon, na ginagawa namin ito para sa iyo. And Lord, ang uh, aming cell group, we are declaring that you will not just add, but Lord, you multiply our cell group. Maraming salamat. We will uh, continue to reach the uh, people. We will continue to reach the community. And Lord, hindi lang po namin sila ma-reach, Lord God, like a one-time event. But Lord, maging uh, life-changing dahil sa cell group, Lord God, mailalagay po sila 
Amen. And uh, alam po namin na patuloy ka pong uh, kasama namin in uh, Multiplying the Cell Group. You are continually moving in each and every uh, cell group, Lord God, ng aming simbahan. That's why we pray, Panginoon, na patuloy kang uh, kumilos, Lord, sa um, mga churches ng uh, aming Uh, sa mga churches, Lord God, ng Christ International Fellowship, including, Lord, we are praying uh, the uh, pastors, Panginoon, patuloy, Panginoon, ang, ang fruit and fire of the Holy Spirit. We are declaring, Lord, um, direction and provision, comfort to Pastor Gani, Pastor Tess, Pastor Hias. Lord God, at uh, sa mga uh, kapastoran ng uh, Christ International Fellowship, I know, Lord, na patuloy mo kaming tinutulungan in, in raising our 12. And Lord, may you give each and every pastor protection, wisdom, discernment, Lord God. Kung meron mang po may sakit, uh, may continue to heal each and every uh, pastor. Ganon din po, Panginoon, with Um, the IPHC, PPHC, bishops, missionaries, pastors, leaders, and churches, may we continue to see, Lord God, a unity, direction, provision, uh, protection, uh, fruitful, fruitfulness, Lord. Pinapanalangin din namin, Lord, ang G12 international leaders and national leaders, uh, pastors, and uh, disciples, Panginoon, ilalapit namin lahat ito sa iyo. Lord God, Lord, uh, may you continue to raise cell groups uh, in our uh, church. May you continue to raise leaders, Lord God, sa lahat ng simbahan ng Christ International uh, Fellowship. And Lord, right now we are declaring uh, unity, Panginoon, sa bawat pamilya, sa bawat cell group. At uh, kung mayroon man pong uh, may sakit, anyone... Uh, any prayer requests in the comment section, we are declaring answer, Lord God, special healing sa lahat ng mga taong nangangailangan ngayon ng kagalingan, Lord God. Panginoon, um, may you continue to move, especially um, in this uh, place, a nation, Lord God, ng Pilipinas. Uh, I, I declare, Lord, uh, nation transformation. Maraming salamat. Panginoon, dahil alam namin na kasama ka namin at naririnig mo ang lahat ng aming panalangin. In Jesus' name, Amen and Amen. Marami pong salamat sa pagsama po ninyo sa akin sa ating po 3pm daily devotion and, uh, and, and prayer on behalf po ng um, aking pamilya, ng aking misis na si Monica, of course, uh, CIF Ortiga Center, and our uh, senior pastors, uh, Bishop Isagani and Pastor Ates. Again, ako po si Pastor Israel, and magkita-kita pa po tayo sa mga susunod pa pong araw. God bless po sa bawat isa.